is amazing. First time driving the F12, like actually driving it. you guys whoa back in the valley back in LA and back at Gintani where we're about to give you guys an update on the twin turbo f12 hey. pay your fucking bill bro yeah, pay your fucking bills Alex <laughs> nobody pays their bills man nobody pays how are you doing brother I'm good I guess. okay this car has been a pain in the ass, I know I know but listen you listen. fixed some stuff right listen crankcase problem we had solved solved how'd you solve it put the right check valves in the right how place. much fun was that you tore the whole motor down right no we had to take the whole intake manifold off right. that was not fun turbos Jesus. off all that stuff everything what was the other thing we were having an issue with the wastegate creep yeah. loose creep. creep yeah done done cool by the way nice watch thank you sir it must be nice Keep going. Going. must be nice yeah <laughs> now, so we, have a, we have a six <laughs> i've had a really long freaking day but I, know. I, know. I know we have six pound springs in there it's making like four and a half psi so we're gonna change those once yep. we solve the last problem what's your new problem no, our new, like problem, new is problem is that the return line for the turbos is basically returning to the middle of the sump the pressure so, from it yeah. yeah so it goes up and returns to the middle of the sump when the car is running and you got rpm going and it's starting to pull it's okay it can return but the second you let off throttle it starts backing up into the turbos it's not the right place to put it we got to cap that line redo all the oil drain lines put it somewhere else we're going to reroute it okay got to put a check valve in it so it can't bleed back into the turbos you know i'm starting to learn i don't know much about motors but just to cut in here i want to check valve save like literally solve every problem <laughs> you need a lot of check valves when you're doing <laughs> Okay. Yeah, Dave turbo actually turbo. knows how a lot of this works. Alex and Dave were just talking and I stood here just like this. What we can do though is cars back together and it runs. Yeah, you could drive We're gonna car. drive it. Yeah. We're gonna drive the car. We're not gonna rip the hell out of it or anything like that, but we can drive it. The fueling is all done. Timing is all set. We need to get all, all the oil out of the intake because when we can't return, it's flooding the intake manifold. Right. So we're gonna go drive it. We're gonna rip it around a little bit. We're not gonna go too crazy with it, but you guys can see the car drives like a bone stock car. I mean, it doesn't buy, idles perfect, comes down to idle perfect. So we'll go have some so fun just, with it. You know, like some people said in the comments, like I threw Aaron under the bus or something because I made this title that said like failed my car failed I'm saying the car failed and that's Ferrari like never intended this to be a twin turbo car and here I am with it okay this was meant to be a naturally aspirated v12 Aaron never drove the car he started it put it on a trailer and sent it here that was always the plan whoever's leaving comments or whatever saying that they just Aaron, know. Aaron did a bad job or he did it wrong that's completely wrong I mean the guy did a fantastic job his fabrication's amazing everything's badass you just there's little changes you need to make and that's with anything that even goes for us when we first make a kit for a car you know what i mean check valves bro yes check we valve. all need check valves we can start this thing valve. come on In the Gintani lab, as I like to call it, 48 on the dyno, SVJ getting the F1 exhaust, which is super exciting. My car is on its way down as we speak. Alex tells me he has a system already built, so hopefully we're gonna get it in here, put on as soon as possible. Okay guys, I have to stop and thank today's sponsor. State of Survival. This one, you're not gonna wanna miss. State of Survival is a really fun game you get to play. You've probably already played it, but if you haven't, make sure you check it out. But right now, what's even more special is there's a crossover between State of Survival and The Walking Dead. That's right, you can play with The Walking Dead character that's gonna blow your mind, as well as blow the minds of some zombies. The State of Survival and Walking Dead crossover takes place from August until October 2021. That's right, only about a month, month and a bit left, you guys, act quick. You're gonna get a free playable hero. That's right, Daryl. Dixon, the bad, quiet, mean mother from the show The Walking Dead. It features an exclusive plot, new gameplay, and Easter eggs buried in the game. It's also State of Survival's second anniversary. What do you get for second anniversary? Is it paper or plastic? And I'm not very good at that. That's why I'm divorced. However, they have something amazing for you guys. You're gonna get a free legendary hero back out. You're gonna get 200 free lucky draw of in-game items. Not only is this game absolutely crazy with The Walking Dead collab, but they're also gonna give you a chance to win a Lamborghini Huracan. How epic is that. You guys really want to take advantage of this. You can actually win a Lamborghini. I wish I had a Lamborghini here right now. I'm in the Bentley, but you can have a Lamborghini and I'll drive in your Lamborghini Huracan. How sick would that be? An awesome game, which is free to play and you might win a Lamborghini. You've got from September 1st to October 31st to enter. All right, guys, entering is super simple. All you have to do is click the link in the description, download the game, and the giveaway is completely free to enter once you reach level five. It's tons of fun. I've been playing it nonstop. I haven't seen my kids in weeks because I'm playing this bad game. It's 
super easy to upgrade your heroes and the base. There are tons of survival supplies and materials to help you upgrade. It's actually really fun and really simple to play the game. First things first, you have your base. That's where you and your homies hang out. You can fortify it, you can upgrade it. There's so many things you can do to make it more efficient and more safe. There's also challenges. You can literally go out and find zombies to kill. You can have like your friends help you. It's actually like little machine guns. It's actually tons of fun. It has amazing graphics. You can upgrade your characters, weaponry, as well as your base. You can make more food. I've seen a lot of guys in the game eating tomatoes. I mean, apparently in the apocalyptic world, everybody eats tomatoes. I have to learn to like tomatoes. You guys, it's really that easy. The game is super fun to play, as you've seen, and you have a chance to win motherfucking Lamborghini. So stop what you're doing, take two seconds, click the link in the description, and download the game, and enter to win that Lamborghini. Even if you don't win, there's also amazing Amazon prizes. I'll see you guys in the game. Back to the blog. These guys are busy. Look at all the cars in here. This car right here, well, they have a special project going on with this car. Might involve a couple of snails. I can't really, I can't really say much more. We got the 720S up here. Alex's absolutely insane twin turbo Huracan. It's one of the most badass, fastest twin turbo Huracans on the planet. I've driven Dave's car. Dave's car is really fast, so we're gonna have to see. Is it faster? I don't know. We're gonna find out. But there are a lot of fun things going on. These guys fabricate all their own stuff in here. So much work and effort goes into the development of everything that Kintani produces. I'm proud to see how these guys have grown. We got some fun cars out here in the yards. Look at this. 765, McLaren GT, and well, that's right, the twin turbo F12. can put some heat in the engine. We're gonna pull this thing out. We're actually gonna take this thing for a drive. Even though it's still having that one issue left, Alex said, you're not even gonna believe it. It drives so good. So I'm excited. I'm excited to hear it. I'm gonna have some fun with it. And hopefully sometime in the next week, he can get that last problem solved, clear all the codes, and she'll be good to go. Dude. <laughs> Of this thing, if all it ever did was just do this, I'd still be happy. Yeah, I'd just drive it around for and giggles. How crazy do you think this car is gonna be once it's done, done, done? I think good. I think it's gonna make like 800, close, close to 800 wheel. We'll just cap it over there. That's I perfect. Think, I think it's more than enough. This car's stock already straight tires. Yeah, 750, 800 wheel, and you can beat the with it all day. That's, that's all that's, I want, that's, man. That's the, that's the fun part. This was all about shooting flames and making it sound great. Well, I haven't added the flame part yet, but we'll add that. Yeah. I mean, factory ECU, everything works perfect. It's That's gangster. great. Yeah, it is. It's pretty That's gangster. gangster. Holy s***. <laughs> Don't tease me, you son of a <laughs> You hear this? What a monster. Oh, that guy loves you. That guy hates you, bro. That's the neighbor. Same guy when we had the ice cream jam.
Look at man. Woo hoo hoo, yes! Yeah. This car's crazy. It sounds super unique. It sounds like the unicorn. It does. Who's ready to see this thing shred some tire? So insane. Dude, when you pull it up, I can see like, when, he, when he shifted, a puffs of smoke. Oh yeah. I was like... He said, just wait, he's gonna tune it so it shoots flames. Like, boom, 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 out the front of the hood. If you haven't, smash the subscribe button right now, you guys. It's gonna get crazier. Yeah, smash the subscribe right button. Now, We're guys? so close to three million. Right now, today only, it's free. We're not gonna charge him. It's, it's free, free. To, It's free to subscribe, Dave says. You ready for this, you guys? <laughs> Sounds so yeah. I'm up on my plan, which I'm decked up on the roof. Don't stop it to the cash, but they're like gone to the bad bill. Tell her out of my face if she comes with that. Quick to save my peace, I'm so after school special. She brainy, but them jeans looking like paint. I got a bless. <laughs> you can't see anything. The exhaust fumes. You see how it backs up? Yeah. Yeah, see a little bit of the white smoke from the oil backing up. You can't see shit. Everything's kind of like blurred, like wearing sunglasses. Hilarious. God, I love YouTube life. This is amazing. First time driving the F12, like actually driving it. The weirdest feeling is turning the exhaust in front of you. Like, that's probably the craziest part. The weirdest feeling is seeing a freaking all the gaseous shit. All the gases in front of you. It's actually incredible. Oh, the exhaust fumes are starting to affect our... Uh, Everything's funny all of a sudden. Like, all my jokes now make sense because he's high on CO2. Feels like we ate a bunch of chocolate shrooms. <laughs> We're watching a Jimi Hendrix music video now. with these fumes. Amazing. <laughs> what a cool sounding car. You love this shit, hey? Yeah. Stupid shit like this? Stupid or the better? Yeah. Also, we get a Tesla if you don't like this. Want to do Tesla builds next? I don't know. chance. Don't mind me. That's the exhaust speaking right now. The best part is, Damon has no idea. We're driving right next to the police station. Oh, shit. This is the police station. This is where they take oh, you. Oh, shit. The cops. Yeah, cool. This car's totally legit. Com We're good. Completely legal. This is where they come in and out. <laughs> Alex really wants to be in the thumbnail on Tyler, you guys. 90% of them like us. There's a 10% that probably want to kill us. How's the AC, boys? You know what? The problem with this car is it's like it's too cold. In here. But you. My feet are Hurry, I did a burning dance oh, I here. I smell the hair on my legs. Stingy? It's 110 right now and the heat is f***ing cranked. Like, cranked, cranked, cranked. Me and Dave are uh, brewing we're some... A, we're in a sweat lodge. No, we're brewing some serious thug butter. <laughs> You should feel the camera. The camera right now is 100 degrees from being in that car. Woo! It actually feels cold outside right now. That's some serious duck butter we just brewed in that. <laughs> All right, guys, that's a wrap for this thing. I'm gonna pull it in. Woo! Never get sick of that. Oh, we got the little DD love here, DD fan. <laughs> that guy stopped to say what's up. You want to sell the car? DD fam in the house. We're gonna put the F12 away. We're gonna jump in the 720. We're gonna do some shenanigans in the 720 GTR. Thank you to Alex and his team. They tightened up my exhaust. They actually got it on real tight. It was really f***ed up. It was all crooked and f***ed. They had to adjust a whole bunch of stuff. Do me a favor, you guys, and give Gintani a follow on the gram. Show them some love. Because they've been dealing with all my <laughs> Woo, she sounds good. Impression of the uh, F12. It's crazy. The sound is, I didn't expect it to still sound like an F12, but it still does. It's got that high pitch in there somewhere. Yep, it's in there. It's amazing. Dave? It reminds me of the first day of school, grade one. The year was 1991. I was a bit nervous, but it was still fun. There's new noises, there's new teacher. Same thing. Shut the f it's better than his description. What's he talking about? We're gonna put some heat in the engine of the old 720 GTR. Alex, thank you for fixing it. Thank you for working on 
my monster of an idea. You're excited, I can tell you like it. Yeah. Just a little bit of a, yeah, tweak this, that, you know? We're, we're almost there. Everybody's probably sick of hearing me say, we're almost there. We're almost there. <laughs> well, stop <laughs> I'll get it done and pay your f***ing bill, bro. There you go. Why don't you give me a credit card, dude? I don't have one. Yeah, I don't have any money. I'm here to ride his coattails all the way to the top. <laughs> Like this is all you knew and that your dad was like some producer or director of a Hollywood movie and like that was your life Like that's all you knew Because there's people who live here who are like that Woo! So pumped yeah, well, it's almost done. I know I'm gonna help Alex get it done faster I'm good with this stuff. So where do you think I should take the F12 twin turbo for the first like real ride other than just like around the street or around the block? Bruneyard, put that f***er into a wall. Oh my god. The remember, when that, remember when we did that? Oh, I remember I was the pastor. We started and you said, don't hit the wall. Don't hit the wall. And some, people, like, no, no, no. some people said that Damon crashed. He actually didn't. He it's spanned the car I'm about a foot away and thought, I can see the look in his eye, that little thing started happening. And he put it in and I was like, here we go. And when it burst into flames, I thought the car was on fire. I thought, I actually thought it was on fire. The car's written off. That's why I said, get the out of the car. No, you didn't. He said, stay in the car. We do this together. <laughs> like, tell that Louise. I said, hold on, stay in the car. I'll be right back. <laughs> Oh, really? Yeah. So he's not alone? Yeah. Let's make him feel alone right now. Yeah, 